range, 55 miles east of Portland, is fabulous Mount Hood, two miles high. It's great country for skiers, if they can get up there, for clearing the roads to the summit is a tremendous job. Built by the federal government in 1937, some are experienced skiers, and some are just getting their ski legs. Skiers away down Mount Hood's snowy slopes. Thanks to the skiway, here's one place where it takes longer to come down than to go up. A lady from Washington uh, was down for a weekend. And she came to me kind of disturbed and said, look at the, the drapes in my room, they're falling apart. And she suggested that we form a, a non-profit organization. The step that we're engaged on now is to restore the main foyer. The main project we did was the lobby draperies and then the dining room draperies. by the federal government in 1937. Some are experienced skiers, and some are just getting their ski legs. Built by the Forest Service at a cost of $7,200,000, the Day Lodge was designed to house all of the ski-related facilities and day-use activities formerly crowded into Timberline Lodge. inspiration to all of us and uh, that's why we have the museum downstairs named after her and I can remember one board meeting when she sat us all down and, and gave us really a, a sermon 
on how she thought Timberline was a world uh, art institution and that we should treat it that way. And it was much bigger and much more important than the individual board members really thought of it. I think when Barbara Feely came up, her first vision was, you know, this is off scale. This isn't what originally was designed. The Barbara boulders are the, the part that we remember the most, is seeing those huge boulders actually come up the, the roadway here and then put in place. And Ron Van de Hey actually took the rocks and she would sit in a chair and just sort of guide her hand this way and that way. And, and the guys would actually use sort of a crane and move these boulders in place. And then the next thing was to get the vegetation to come back. And she'd sort of wave her hand and say, I'd love to have the purple here and sort of the red tones over here.
gentlemen, fellow Oregonians, guests, the president. Governor Martin, ladies and gentlemen, here I am on the slopes of Mount Hood, where I've always wanted to come. I am here to dedicate Timberline Lodge, and I do so in the words of the bronze tablet which is directly in front of me on the coping of this very wonderful building. Timberline Lodge, Mount Hood National Forest, dedicated September 28, 1937, by the President of the United States, as a monument to the skill and faithful performance of workers on the rolls of the works Progress Administration.